In room 202, FCA meets every Friday A-Shift. FCA stands for Fellowship of Christian Athletes, but the name can be deceiving. Any, any student here at the high school can come. Uh, we make it available to all students, whether they participate in the sport or not. Um, the only thing that we, um, that we do, since it is Fellowship of Christian Athletes, is usually um, whatever message we have that we talk about is usually going to involve athletics in some form or fashion. For athlete Jacob Leisinger, FCA has been a big part of his high school career. I started going to FCA in junior high. There was one at Holmes that uh, Mr. Peters, our PE teacher, started. And uh, I've been a part of the one here at the high school since sophomore year. So in total, like, this is my fifth year coming to FCA. Why should you come to FCA? Um, usually we just try to make it a really easy and laid back atmosphere. Like you can, you can show up, you can be yourself, and you can come and kind of share how things are going in your life. Um, and usually there's some sort of message. Sometimes like today we happen to be playing a game. Um, we got the old Nintendo 64 out and playing some Mario Kart and have some food. So um, usually we try to make it an easy laid back atmosphere, but um, most Fridays we're in there. We want to um, get, get into the word, get into the message a little bit in terms of the Bible and um, just learn about um, what it means to maybe be a disciple here. Um, at Cedar Falls High School. I'll uh, just expect it to be like a, you know, like a really like fun, but like also like safe environment to be able to say whatever you want and uh, know that you're not going to be in trouble, you're not going to be like judged, and no matter what background you come from, you don't have to go to church or uh, do any sort of thing like that. As long as you just come, then uh, people will be welcoming and uh, people will want to talk to you and uh, share with you and basically it's just going to be a really positive environment and uh, somewhere where you can come and uh, start your faith with Jesus. FCA didn't always meet during power hour but the leaders are really liking the new setup. You know I think that really helped us out because we found that just trying to find the time is the hardest thing to figure out whenever any club is meeting and so the fact that um, we used to meet on Monday nights but then that just became really difficult as students were busy and they were already going to other church activities or they had athletics that they were going to too and practices and games. And so finding an, an evening during the week was really difficult. So we were really excited to be able to put it during the school day and then the, the access to, um, to FCA for students here at the high school became a lot easier. Um, so now it's just a matter of making sure that we can get the word out that we're meeting and when we're meeting and get people involved um, to hopefully make a difference here at the high school. I love it because otherwise I'm... But before it was at this time, I wasn't able to attend many meetings because there are nights or other times when I was busy. So I just, I love this opportunity to get together over lunch. Fantastic. My Christianity and like my faith uh, in, in Jesus is like a big part of my life. So it's, it's nice to be able to get together with other people who like share that same value and uh, to spend time with uh, friends and teammates and stuff. And also the sports and uh, faith sort of mesh together there and like sports is obviously another big part of my life so uh, it's nice to be able to uh, just sort of talk to people about how those tie into each other and uh, learn and grow from it. FCA. What I love about FCA is the opportunity to share the gospel of Jesus Christ with students that uh, Christ died for them and that he offers to them eternal life through faith and so that's exciting just to be able to share that message the love of God with the kids. This has been Adrian Diaz, Abdul Majid Rashtagic, reporting for the Tiger Highline.